Hello my friends, welcome to another TFT video. If you like this kind of content, make sure you subscribe and let's get right into it. Bard levels each player up to three. <laughs> okay, starts to... Seems like we're gonna have a pretty interesting game here where we're gonna try to hit fast level 10 and hit as many five costs as we possibly can. That's just my speculation, but we'll see how it goes. What are we gonna get here? Oh, he also gives you champs to be level three which is pretty nice. Some bruisers, some dryads. You know, if I get enough Nars, this could be the Nar game. I haven't gone Nar yet, but I have seen him destroy many, many people in front of me. And that is a Nar item. Uh, take that. And Mythic Heavenly Arcanist. Hmm. This is cool. This is cool. We, we actually don't even have to pre-level or anything. We could just chill out. Sit on these units and see what else we get. We'll find out soon enough. Ooh, a Nasher's Tooth. Oh, nice. That's awesome. Okay, we'll take that. Mythic Invoker Sniper. No, nope, we don't really want that. Ghostly Ink Shadow Bruiser. Another Bruiser is not bad. I wonder if we will hit that in our next guess we'll find out soon enough that's another ink shadow which i like i like that that's pretty cool and we have another sniper sitting in there oh uh oh, wow that's absolutely useless to us okay well aphelios is good umbral crest lucky pause getting a two-star kabuko your strongest kabuko's ability it deals 300% damage. If Kabuko kills an enemy, they have a chance to drop a 100% chance to... Oh. Well, it does seem like I'm going some sort of bruiser build. Any, I'm going to try it. I'm going to try it. I just want to. I just want to try it. There's, there's no other reasoning behind my thought process other than just wanting to see how it's done. This fortune stuff might not be too bad either. It looks like I just need a third fortune unit in order. Oh, oh, uh, yeah. Okay, well, that is a very early fortune game. I'm not really sure how to play fortune. I think it's like heart steel, but we'll find out. Luck per loss, one. Luck per penalty per win, 10%. Each player, or player combats until reward, zero. One gold. I don't know what that does, but we'll figure it out soon enough. Okay, I think I could probably sell some of my units for eco. I'm just not sure exactly what I'm going to sell. I probably don't need this. And I probably don't need this. And this either. I'm picking that up for no reason. I'm putting some bruisers down. I need kabukos. It would be really sweet if I was able to three-star him. But I definitely want to start making Econ because he scales off of me making Econ. So we want that. Shadow Duelist, Duelists, Dragon Lord. Nope, we don't really need any of these. We can't hit 5 Fortune without getting a Spat. But a Spat is always nice. And I think I want to lose as this. I'm going to sell all that just to make the Eco. I'm going to sell this and keep that. And hopefully we hit a Kabuko 3-star. He's a magic tank, so I definitely want to build some items on him. 100% chance to drop one gold, huh? I hope we get to see that at all. I would really like to. But it looks like he does zero damage, so it seems unlikely. Maybe I'm better off with getting Tristana items so that she can uh, actually do some damage for me. Looks like Teemo is really the one that's carrying me too. He's the one that's actually doing damage. And I am very hurt right now. It looks like I am super hurt. It hurts to be alive. Oh, uh, I could push my luck. Get a bigger cash out. Yeah, I'll push my luck. Sure. Okay, that's a lot of rounds. It looks like I'm going to have very low HP by the time it comes back, but it will have to be this way. Another bruiser. Ink Shadow, maybe. 
I could put Volley Bear in, even though I know I just lost him last round. Volley Bear would have been a good pick here. I could have replaced that dude. Man, if we find him again, we're definitely putting him back in. So it would be him for him, and then Volley Bear at the next level to give me Duelist. All right. All right. Okay. Hard L, it seems. Maybe Teemo can carry. Trick Shot's kind of awesome. Bounces the attack off of units onto other units. Reminds me of this one trait called Cannoneer that they used to have. Well, hopefully I get a huge cash out from this. Definitely have to get a pretty decent cash out since I keep dying. Dying. Oh, is that? Oh, dude, come on, man. I needed that. Guess I'll take this. Then I can still get a last whisper for her. Okay, I think I see what I'm going to do. I think I see exactly what I'm going to do. And it's going to be sell most of my bench. And then make all of the replacements that I have to make here. Okay, so that's very nice that we just hit that naturally. Put that in there. We'll sell that. We'll put that in there. We'll sell all of this. And yeah, that's a lot better of a board than we just had before. That's for sure. I could give him a Nasher's Tooth. I'm sure he would be pretty good with it off with a Nasher's Tooth. But it kind of... Oh, this is a hard choice. Very, very difficult choice. I think it's okay if we keep losing for a little bit longer just so we can try to get the most amount of rewards. Rewards. Oh, this guy's going the same thing I'm going. This might have been the dude that picked the tryst. Oh, Kabuko actually farmed me a gold. Thank you, brother. Thanks for that gold. Uh, I didn't really exactly want to win here, but it's just what happened. There's nothing more to be said about that. That's rough. All right, well, we can live with that. We can live with that. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, is it fine? I don't really know. Luck penalty for win. 10% though. So is it lowering my my outcome here? Kind of looks like it might be. Diana offers you a treasure army that can be rerolled three times. Okay. What are we going to get here? Something good? Okay. That is actually not terrible. Except for this. But these two items are kind of awesome. I'm going to reroll. Uh, wow. Mm, that's not great. Uh, not great. Come on. Okay. All right. I like this, actually. I like this a lot. I'm glad I rerolled it all of the times that I did. Because this is going to be good on her. This is going to be good on him. And this is going to be good on him. Then I could either do a Nasher's Tooth or a Last Whisper. I don't know if I want to st start slamming items. I guess I've already slammed a few. I'm going to do it. <laughs> I have no self-control. I'm going to do it anyway. Whatever, man. If I already won the last round, I might as well try to win this round. You know how it goes. Oh, okay. Well, the the Rage Blade is certainly a very good slam on her, for sure. Yeah, that's pretty strong. It looks like Teemo still carried anyway. Thanks, Teemo. You're doing you're doing work, son. I'm proud of you. Ink Shadow. I could play one more Ink Shadow, but who Ooh. Kaisa would be awesome in this comp. A Kaisa dude? That would give me Trick Shot and Ink Shadow. It would be a beautiful trait, trait list here. Everything would match up so beautifully. And it looks like I'm only on Krug, so it's it's very possible that I might hit all, everything that I need. Don't need that, though. Get him, get him. Okay, well, I could do this. I could slam a Guard Breaker on her. Mm, but probably don't want to do that, honestly. I don't want to do that. I want to get like a, 
a Warmogs and uh, Infinity Edge. Even Infinity Edge would be better than just, I don't know, frustrating. Oh, there's nothing I could, yeah, there is. I could just put, sure. I like that. I like that. I think I'll take that. I'll take a trick shot if I find a trick shot. But since I didn't find a tri trick shot at that shop, wow, that's like a tongue twister. I can't believe it. I guess my tongue is pretty warmed up today. So I can do tongue twisters. Ooh, look at look at that one star Trisco. And is that the second guy carrying with Kindred? I think it is. Is Kindred good? Oh, sleeper OP? Oh man, he's just j jumping around. No! No! Yes! Wow, amazing. I, like I said, I still don't think I want to win. I think I'm not getting any rewards from my actual trait. But it's too late. This is what it's going to be like. Because I've already decided. Okay. The Golden Remover. Gain a Golden Remover and a Component Anvil. I don't know what a Golden Remover is. Is that like... Is that any different than... Not a golden remover. This is attack speed. I like that. Team building is kind of sick. I might take... I know... Oh, one and two champions. Oh, man. I think I might have to take that. That's, like, insanely good. And this is a way better sniper than her. I know. I know I, she was just in there for the trait. But, dude, I think Ash is really strong. Like, she's kind of insane. I'd almost kind of want to slam these items on her. I, I don't want to lose fortune, so I'm not going to do that, but I would definitely slam these two trust items on her and just hope for the best because she, she's so good. It looks like snipers just deal extra damage for how far they are. Okay, all right. Wow, that is a tanky boy right up front. Very tanky boy. I suppose it's good that we lost here because we needed to. But I don't like losing at all, so it, it pains me. It pains me to have died there. Okay, wow. Wow, are we just getting so lucky, dude? We're just getting kind of super lucky. I don't know if there's a point in me keeping her now. Ah, but I want her, dude. I want her. She's just so strong. She's just so strong. I don't know. I don't think it's worth leveling up to put her in right now or anything, but she's so good. Okay, we'll do that and call it a day. See where this takes us. Maybe I should transfer the items to Kaisa. It's hard to say. Oh, okay. Well, 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 oh, all right, hey, yikes, yikes, you know, Timo's doing great, though, I'm very proud of him, he's, he's doing work, okay, that's a little bit more gold, so that's good, seven luck per loss, I, I don't know what this means, I really wish I did, when you lose a fight, gain luck, the more fights in a row you lose, the more luck you get. We're gonna fill the care. Oh, dude. Dude. Dude, I don't even know who to go for. I was gonna go for Annie, I lied. I knew exactly who I was gonna go for. Do I need a sword? Do I need a bow? I'll just take Kaisa. Kaisa's just good. What if I two star her right here? I mean, that would kind of be insane. I'm doing it on the wild assumption that I'm just gonna two cost her right here and it's gonna be fine. Oh, uh, okay, okay, all right, uh, I will cash out. Let's see if I get anything good there. A little bit of gold, huh? Five turns until the next go. Hmm, could do this. Could do that. Close to leveling up again. Close to that Kaisa. I just need to find one more 
interests so I can remove these items off of her. Even though she is doing excellent work, I think I would rather have that on Kaisa. I think she could put a little bit more work in. And I'm really holding that ash, holding onto her tightly without even knowing if I'm ever going to use her in the soul match. But maybe we will, so that's why she's there. And I guess she's not really ruining our eco or anything, so it's not the worst case scenario that she's just sitting on the bench watching us hang out. Hanging out. She looks so cool. <laughs> I really like the art style of the set. Alright, well, now she's just going in there for funsies. You having fun? I hope so. Ooh, man. If I had... What's her name? Caitlin? If I had a Caitlin and I just put her in there, it wouldn't really make my board that much stronger or anything, but I like having all the traits active. Like a whole row of traits active. And then if I get Stand United, oof, that would be crazy. Oh, this is the other guy that's going Fortune Units. Who's the last Fortune Unit that I'm missing? Zoe. Huh. Oh, is that even worth it for me to invest in fortune anymore? I think I'm just better off sticking to this really wide comp that I've made. <laughs> Kabuko is actually doing some damage. I don't know how he started to, but I'm proud of him for getting around to it. Okay. We're uh, chilling. We're waiting. Alilia. Oh, Alilia, dude. Alilia is just really strong, I feel like. She might synchronize well with Annie. I think she would synchronize very well with Annie. Okay, well, we're, we're shooting you. Yeah, 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 gotcha. Gotcha. More AP, huh? It's not bad. It's kind of what we need. I'm going to level up here and roll down a little bit. Oh, okay. Why? How? How are we so lucky that that's just what we're going to get like that. Can I have my items? Thanks. Thank you. That and this is what you're going to get. So you can do some damage. And then we're going to itemize Odir. So Odir can do some damage and live as long as possible. We'll see what we'll give him. Oh, Kabuko, thanks. Thanks, dude. You're such a you're such a pal for farming me that, that gold here and there. I really appreciate that. Maybe eventually I do take him out of there. I'm unsure. Oh, the four cost champion you buy is instantly up. Oh, dude. Dude. Oh, dude. That's so good. Bruiser Crest. No, I don't really care for that. Oh, I don't really care for that. I'm gonna I'm gonna do it. I just feel like I have to. He's a behemoth. Hmm. And then we'll do this right here. Give him a little oomph. Man, I <laughs> I, I don't know what to do here. I'm uh, at a bit of a loss. But I think that putting a Zier in there would not be a bad choice. And I think... I think I lose... I think it's time to lose uh, my fortune bonus and just start going into other stuff. Like, better stuff. Oh, okay. All right. All right, Udir. Thanks for being such a dear friend. Yes. Yes. 
I'm gonna do it. I think I'm just gonna do it. <laughs> I mean, what is happening? Why am I finding, am I just really lucky right now? I'm gonna do that. Sorry, Kabuko, you never got to pop off, friend. I was hoping that you did, but you really just didn't. I know that takes trick shot away. I'll figure something out about it. I don't need duelist really. Okay, well, uh, I couldn't really position that properly, but it's all good. Take that. Do I have another invoker? Nope. All right, well, uh, I like that. This has to be a stronger board, right? In kind of every sense of the word. <laughs> Duelist, uh, I don't know. That's that's not something that I need right now. Wow. Okay, Kaisa's Kaisa's doing a great job in there. Mythic. Okay. Well, uh, I don't know what item I'm really going for. Oh, ribbon adds a component to each champ. That's awesome. I want either this or this. Way would be awesome. I really kind of want to get way right there just to multiply my champs. Okay, well, I got way. You you ask for way, you get a way. I want to keep Ink Shadow in, I believe. Who do I replace here? I don't think I replace anybody. I think I just level up and I call it a day. More five costs, huh? More and more five costs, huh? Okay. I like that. I'm gonna get get these guys. I'm gonna sell these guys. And then he's a fighter, right? Yep, he's an attack fighter. I think I'm just gonna wait. Gonna wait it out for a second. I mean, would it really be so bad if I lost Ink Shadow? Gain a unique Ink Shadow items. Unique Ink Shadow champions gain 5% bonus damage and damage reduction. Hmm. That's probably worth it. It's probably worth keeping in there for Kaisa to do more damage. But I mean, if I could put some 5 costs in there, some more 5 costs, that would be really good. I can start two starring them pretty quickly, thanks to Huey. See, like, what if I were to do like something like this, maybe? And she's trick shot. Man, I think it has to be done. I think. I think that it has to be done. I think it has to be done right here. Is there another duelist in there? There sure is. Who's my other duelist? Oh, it's him. Okay, well. <laughs> if anything, I definitely want to two-star her, so. Wow, my, my board is pretty crazy looking with uh, all the colors and effects that I have. Wow. Okay, that's good stuff right there. Look at all these awesome traits. I suppose I did say I wanted to get a lot of five costs this game. I'm pretty sure this is the game I said that at the beginning. And it looks like it might be coming to fruition here. Uh, depending on what items I get here, I could slam some items. I don't really need these guys anymore. I have no regrets about taking them out. Trick shot. Yeah, this is a this is a nice board that I have. Okay, tier, not bad. Sell. Sell that. Let's see what we get here. I think I'm gonna roll down a little bit. Okay. We take those. 
we also take those and uh, we'll do this as well. Set, I think you you're due for some items, my friend. You're definitely due for some items, but what do we give you? I hope that actually slammed on him and not a random person. I really dislike it when that happens. Oh man, this guy is really strong as well. But trick shot? Oh, it wasn't enough. It was almost enough, but it wasn't enough. That's okay, we still have some items yet to slam. So a little bit of lifesteal would be good, and I'm not sure. I'm not sure what other item. I, I guess I could do this. Bramble Vest, maybe? I mean, it wouldn't be bad. It'd give him some more HP. I think I'm going to do this, though. And then he's also a magic tank, I'm pretty sure. So this is actually perfect for him. Yep. I can live with that. I can live with these decisions that I've made. It'd be really nice to three-star set, but it would take quite a long time in order to be able to. Maybe we do it anyway, <laughs> or at least we try. Give it a good old try. Ooh, oh dear, two-star would also be very good. I think really just two-starring any of these units would be a wonderful time for me. Nice. Built that Orn item right on who my carry is. Let's keep rolling just a little bit. Yep, that's exactly the amount of time that I wanted to roll. I think I just, yeah. Like, I want to go for the glory of three-starring set because a three-star set would fulfill me. But also winning would fulfill me. So if I get to put, if I get to put a two-star way in there, my chances of winning have gone up exponentially. And look at set, just do some push, do some work workouts. Boom! <laughs> that slam is very satisfying. Is he still alive? No, it looks like he didn't make it, but it's okay. Nice. I didn't know Orn made more than one item. Thought he could only make one item per round. That's awesome. Yeah, if I get another set here. Oh, there is no other set here. What do I go for? None of those. Hmm. I guess I'll go for the Nasher's Tooth. Just to give Azir another item. I guess Kai a Kai Sai item would have been good too, but I'm not sure. Not sure what was on there for Kaisa. Darn, nothing crazy, huh? Okay, well. <laughs> and another one of him, huh? Maybe two starring everyone's the way to go here. To just drop set, pick him up. There we go. He is fully itemized, so getting a, a two-star of him would be pretty good. Oh, man. This guy is going Kabuko as well. How have, I feel like I haven't seen this guy in the entirety of the game. <laughs> Where was he the whole time? That is one really large Kabuko. Maybe we can bully him in the corner in a submission. Yep. Yep, we sure can do that. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. I like to see it. I like to see that. And did we get the... Yes! That's awesome. Okay, two-star Huey is next. Let's see what we're fighting up against. The porcelain dude. 
with a set as well. That's interesting. It's probably who we're going to be fighting up against. How strong is our set from his working out? 56%, huh? That's pretty good. His ult is just so awesome. Oh, he is stunned forever. Yeah, it doesn't matter. He at least comes back for it. Oh, man, this guy is really strong, though. His Ash is a very scary, very scary lady. Okay, well. Oh, oh, is it? yes, that was close. So, I mean, she almost killed me anyway. Good thing Azir is doing that much damage. Another Azir. I still haven't completely lost hope in three-starring one of these fellers. It's possible. We're all at 50 HP somehow. Oh, this guy is crazy. Six bruiser. Imagine if he went to eight. <laughs> this Kabuko is huge. I wish I could bench that Kabuko with my set. That would really help help set out a little bit by growing very, very large every every turn. Yeah, that's a decent amount of gold here to roll down with. Okay. So we sell that. We buy this. We sell this. Another deer. Okay, so it doesn't really matter which one of these we sell. Now, what item should we get here? Maybe a our new fresh two cost. Let's give her an item. There we go. Oh, this is the really, really tanky Kabuko. We'll see. We'll see how our team fa fares against this guy. Dude, Silas is just crazy. Whenever he dashes to your back line and does that, it's unbelievable. Unbelievable. Oh my. Are you serious? A loon? Dude, a loon. Why do you do this to me, a loon? Why? Why do you do that? Oh, this guy also has Ash. My mortal enemy, Ash. She's a very strong lady. So we're going to sell him, since we already have him. And we already have that as well. Rip. Rip in pieces, friends. Two-star Udyr, I think, would come quite a bit handy here. And then maybe another front line? I'm not sure. Oh, man. Did my set just get suplexed? <laughs> that's embarrassing. What am I fighting? Who is that tiny champ that's dodging everything? It's a Moo Moo. A Moo Moo. How are you dodging everything like that? How are you? Oh, wow. That's crazy. That's crazy. I thought my team was strong, but this Ash, dude, she's showing me a whole new mini meaning of the word. Okay, two more turns to survive and maybe get another two costs. I definitely wanted to be a deer. This is a tough game. Our boards are very strong. If this guy hit six warden somehow, uh, I'm not sure how I would feel about that. That would be a little crazy. A little insane if he were to do that. Maybe I can actually beat this guy. Are they both using Ash? No. One of them is just using a loon. Oh. Lots of wardens taking zero damage. Too much defense. <laughs> Melt him anyway. All right. Let's see what we can get this round. An Aurelia with a component that we don't exactly need. But an Aurelia nonetheless. I'll take her. That guy is going to get 
a two-star chick here. Well, two-star Lysandra, which is a little crazy. Oh, did I? No, no, I did get the right thing. Wow. Still no luck there. I think I could have three-starred Orn a very long time ago if I would have tried. But I didn't. So there's that. I don't even know what he does in three, uh, if he's a three-star. 1,200% shield, huh? That seems pretty good. Maybe that could have tanked for me long enough for me to survive. It's hard to tell. We'll see. Okay, I knew I'd be fighting a loon, and I think a loon's ability is to put, like, a giant attack across a certain row. So I did that in order to hopefully dodge out of that. Dude, I hope I really win this. I want to get Udyr on the board at least. Udyr deserves to be on the board. He hasn't gotten his time to shine yet. Oh no, dude. Oh no, dude. It was so close. But look at that Kabuko. He's like unstoppable. Okay. Well, GG. That was an insane game.